Active to Mr. Lee Bon Chai, the Beauty Director General of Batik Group and the Head of Campus Director. Bell Team Regiment Team, Honorable Chargers, Teacher, Contestant, Student, Lady and Gentlemen. Very good morning, everyone. May I introduce myself? Well, my name is Simpun Lee Min Heng. I am the Laboratory Contestant from Bell Team International School Campus A Team Sabrek A. Today, I'm so excited that I can stand here to join in the final round of this English speaking competition. And for my topic today is What are the benefits of doing exercise? Ladies and gentlemen, before I start my topic, I would like to explain you two key words. Benefits and exercise. The word benefits means on a round table again profit from something. Six hands. Exercise. Exercise means the activity requiring physical that can improve your health and fitness. So now let's move back to our interesting topic. The definition of exercise is the movement of your body that makes your muscles work and your body burns the calorie. There are many types of exercise, such as walking, swimming, cycling, jogging, or dancing. Doing exercise can provide health benefits on both physically and mentally. First, maintain in a healthy body. In fact, exercise can help keep you in a healthy way. Exercise can help people with lose weight and lower the risk of some diseases. Exercising regularly decreases a person's risk of developing certain diseases. Secondly, many symptoms of anxiety and depression. Exercise can help you feel happier. When you have depression or anxiety, exercise often seems like the last thing you want to do. But once you get motivated, exercise can make a big difference. Exercise can help prevent and improve a number of health problems, including high blood pressure, diabetes, and arthritis. The link between depression, anxiety, and exercise aren't entirely clear. But working out and other form of physical activity can definitely be a symptom of depression or anxiety, and it and it can help you feel better. Exercise may also help keep depression and anxiety from coming back when you are feeling better. So. Have brain health and memory. My interest in brain health benefits of exercise are not come only from my work as a physical therapist and researcher in the field, but it also driven from a very personal place that unfortunately many of us have witnessed or will witness in our lifetime, like a family member with sibling memory loss. Finally. Regular exercise is an important part of a healthy lifestyle. Study after study so that the benefits it can have. Not only is that regular exercise can manage your weight and reduce the risk of developing disease, it also can improve and treat mental or health problems. Exercise can also boost your well-being and mood, and it is a great way to unwind from the stresses of life. So now my presentation is coming to the end. Mm, before it ends, I have an important message to all of my beloved audience. Please don't forget to do exercise regularly because exercise not only change your body, it change your mind, your heart tissues, and your mood. That's all for my presentation. I would like to thank to all the participants who are listening to me. Thank you. My respected to Mr. Lee Bun Chai and all the participants. My question is. How to motivate people to do exercise? Um, thank you for your wonderful question. To motivate people to do exercise, it is not easy. But for my own idea, I think that I should be the first person to do exercise, and then we saw the result to other people. When they saw, uh, when they see the result, good, they will come and do exercise with me. And one more thing, we need to tell them all the benefits of doing exercise. Thank you. Uh, good morning. My respects to Mr. Lee Bunche and all participants. Good morning, Charles. 
Uh, could you tell me, am I too old to exercise? Mm, no. Um, thank you for your question. You are not too old to do any exercise because exercise it can, you can do every time if you are old or you are young because exercise it is really important for your health. Like I mentioned before, there are three main points that, uh, that is the benefits of doing exercise. Like the first, maintaining a healthy body. Second, manage symptoms of depression or anxiety. And third, help brain health and memory. Thank you. For the first of all, I would like to give my highest respects to Mr. Lee Boon Chai, the head of ESL, the head of Compress Director, Bell Team Management Teams, respected to the honorable judges, contestants, and all the audience who attend here to listen to my presentation today. My name is Song Vidu. I am a student for the World 9, Group 2, full time from the Compress Element. Today, I have a very great honor to get in here and present all of you guys about one wisdom of His Excellency. Dr. Lee Change states that no satisfaction is better than success from our own ability. So before we begin with this topic, I would like to give all of you guys one key word, the word satisfaction. Satisfaction, it means that the pleasant feelings that you get it when you receive something that you wanted. So to be successful is to do some things that you want to do and to become successful. Living in one society, everyone always wishes to be successful. And to be successful, people use many, many different ways. For the good people, they use their education, their knowledge, their skill that they get from their family, school, or society to achieve everything that they want or to succeed in their dreams from their own ability. And this we call the real success. For the other people, they can be used the money to achieve everything that they want to. Well, for the other meaning, if you achieve some things that you want and that's make you satisfied, then I think that is your success. So being successful is mean that the achievement of a goal or a dream. So today, I'm going to tell all of you guys three main points that relate to this topic. The first point is, most of the people wonder that how to be successful. Well, a person can become successful by working hard or having a wanting attitude on that goal. A very important ingredient to be successful is determination. For example, if you are going to get the real success, you have to be determined to never give up on your dreams, no matter what is the situation might be. And another very important ingredient is work hard. As we cannot expect to be successful if we don't work hard, in this wonderful world that we live in today, a person cannot be successful if he or she doesn't prepare to work hard. To be a successful doctor, you have to read a lot. To be a successful businessman, you have to work hard. And to be a successful lawyer, you have to spend a lot of your energy. Second point, success is the product of satisfaction and happiness. Without being happy on doing one work, the result will never come up. For example, when a man loves his job, he shows his emotions, his love, his like, his thought, and all those things always make him to succeed. So satisfaction is a very important ingredient of success. And satisfaction is a step higher than success. If your destination is satisfaction, then automatically you will meet your real success. Real success is something that we should strive to attend. And real success can be said as to achieve a higher position or a very high position in our chosen area. It can be in politics, it can be in business, or even in education. So real success is all about feeling satisfaction. We can get it by remembering what we have did and how we achieve it. Third point. Being successful is not about being rich or winning at work. It's also about our own personal fulfillment. In this wonderful world that we live today, we have achieved many things from success, such as car, house, money, fortunes, and prosperity. Having money is also a part of being successful. We believe that when a person has enough money to be able to afford what he or she wants, however, money is not the only key to the seat in life or money is not necessity. On the other hand, most successful people can be the key to develop a country or society. For example, a country without successful people is just like a country without developments. In conclusion, to be successful, one has to understand what is the important in that instance, recognize and work hard on a weakness. And I believe that most successful people, before they success, they always learn to suffer and learn from the failure. 
So ladies and gentlemen, if today you fail, but that's not mean tomorrow you're gonna fail again. So don't give up in your dreams, no matter what is the situations might be. Just believe in yourself and follow your dreams. And finally, I have nothing to pay all of you guys back just for Obuda wishes, longevity, happiness, peaceful and prosperous. And remember that success is not a key to happiness, but happiness is the key to success. Thank you so much for listening. Thank you. My respected Mr. Lee Moon Tai and all the participants, okay. My question is, can you get success if you have a belief, but there are no opportunities for you? Why or why not? Thank you so much for your um, amazing questions. Well, I think that to be successful is to do some things that we want to do. And to become successful from our own ability, we need to be determination, we need to work hard, and we need to believe in ourselves that we can do it. And from all that three things, we will become a successful person to have, in order to have our country, our society, and our family. Thank you. Good afternoon. My Good afternoon. respects to Mr. Lee Bun Chai and all the participants. Could you tell me what have you learned most from this topic? Thank you so much for your wonderful questions. Well, I have learned a lot from these topics. From the day that I start to work hard, from the day that I start to focus on what my study, from the day that I start to believe in myself that I can do it, and from the day that I start to work hard every time. It's, all, it's make me to stand on this stage right now to present all of you guys such a wonderful topics like this. And I feel very grateful for all that three things. Thank you.